Many call them beer goggles. They're also known as alcohol goggles. Military police had two pair on hand, one simulating a .15 blood alcohol level, the other a .20. Soldiers also learned about other drugs and watching out for their buddies. You see that soldier every single day. And you know when something's not right with that soldier. Some 200 soldiers got hands-on experience in several stations, ranging from putting out fires to rolling over in a vehicle. The troops had fun, but the message is serious. Rather than sitting in a classroom, uh, death by PowerPoint, so to speak, uh, we get them out, uh, hands-on, uh, to remind people of what it is that they need to do in order to do the right thing. Most of these items are not new items. It's just reinforce what they already know. Summer brings more than longer days. Statistically, it's a high-risk time of year for vehicle, water, and sports-related accidents. I just think that uh, safety needs to become a mindset in all activities, not just work activities, but during off-duty activities. Soldiers, civilians, family members all need to think about the activities that they're doing and minimize their risk and their exposure. You're not only endangering yourself, you're endangering others. Leaders lauded the day as successful overall. Some are already getting a head start planning for the next safety campaign. In the October-November time frame where we'll talk about and demonstrate some of the things that safety-wise we can prevent in the winter. Daniel Day, Heidelberg, Germany.